Hi y'all, welcome back to the channel. I am so sorry it has been so long since we've recorded anything. Things have been absolutely crazy getting ready for the holidays. And my husband has been traveling a lot for work, so it has just been a lot to juggle lately. But we have so much exciting content planned for you, so be sure to stick around because I cannot wait to share everything with you. So for today's video, I'm doing something a little bit different. It is my husband's birthday and he is biking today. So I have a few hours in the studio and I wanted to surprise him. Last year he went on a fishing trip to Cabo and he caught this beautiful Marlin. So I am going to paint it for him today for the office. I think he's going to be shocked and I cannot wait to get started. Um, to help things just speed along, I have painted a birch panel with just a blue background and that's gonna serve as the base to get started for our painting. Okay, so the first step is to do our initial sketch of the painting. Whenever I am painting something in this like loose impressionistic style, I always say start big with your sketch and then refine it down to detail. So you wanna just think in big basic shapes so I'm gonna start with a bronze yellow. I think that's going to contrast really nicely with this blue background. And what I'm gonna do is just do some initial mark making and just try and emulate that basic shape of the fish. So going with long fluid motions. Once I have a few marks on the canvas, I like to go in with a secondary color, a secondary color and start cleaning it up a little bit. So I'm using this to take mental notes of what I'm gonna keep and what lines I'm gonna erase. Michael went on this fishing trip last year for his 30th birthday and he went with his dad while I was pregnant. Um, so it was kind of like the last hurrah before we had Romy. So I know this painting is going to be so special to him because it is such cherished memories. So next one to do is go in with background colors and just add in some chunks of colors to really start refining that shape.
this is not a tutorial because I don't know what I'm doing. Honestly, I'm figuring it out right now. So this is more of just exploration and kind of insight into my process as an artist. just finished. I am so excited to give this to Michael. I'm going to wait for it to dry and then I'm going to wrap it up and give it to him for his birthday. I hope that y'all enjoyed watching. I hope that you learned some new techniques and this gave you some helpful insight into my work. Um, if you enjoyed, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit subscribe and we look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye y'all.